trying so hard not to cough right now. Um, I've been up for almost an hour and it feels like I woke up fucking uh, one minute ago still. So, sorry, this game is loud. Forgot to mention. Yeah, I'm just gonna cough. Oh my god. Uh, where even am I in this game? Hold on, let me check my audio real quick. I, sorry. Okay. Looks like it's good. I have to check the audio at the beginning of every stream now. I, I, I just don't trust it anymore. Did it reset my audio settings? This feels like even louder than normal. What the fuck? Dude. He's goaded. Oh my god. Dude, why is it still telling me this graffiti? Obviously. Everyone knows that. It's chapter 3, dude. We get it. We know. Why is the Twilight Zone on every channel? God about the manuscript pages. Take a day off playing this game. If it, it actually, it felt like a week. I've got a brand new combine harvester, and I'll give you. The oh wait, wait. This is like actually scary. a flare? Like what? Do I get it to destroy things? Wait, yeah, destroy this gate. Wait. Is it opening? Very, very slowly. Really? Okay. Fine. Try to, try to not kill them. Okay, fine, fine. I'll fucking kill them. Oh, thanks. I 
actually stopped it? It's crazy. It's open. Come on. We're going to get you out of here, Brody. Come on. Oh, oh. No! No, he's so close! Oh no, he definitely can't fit. Can you stand like right here, maybe? No, no, you're... Okay, you weren't even trying that time. I'm over you. to get to the coal mine. The coal mine wasn't far now. Today, I would meet the dude and he would give me Alice. I Did I actually lose choice. all my weapons again? The man will clutch at a straw. And wait, I guess maybe because it's daytime. I uh, don't have them. These games, uh, well, this game, this game's cutscene, it, it reminds me of like Silent Hill, but. It's like it's like the same cutscene quality as Silent Hill, and it came out like I don't, I don't even know, like twelve years after the first one. I have just gotten in the car. Wonder. Um, well, there's a car here, at least. I can drive it. But by God, it's here. Oh my God, I can't. Well, I probably could have driven that other car, the one I came in on. I just, uh, it, it spawned me out of it, so I just assumed I couldn't. I also assumed I was, like, right at the end. What even happened? Not hitting anything, it's okay. Chill, chill.
this is Pat Main, and you're listening to KBFFM. Folks, I want to apologize for kind of abandoning you to that looping music track last night, but I was detained. You see, I encountered a big shot G-Man with an itchy trigger finger who could use a, a lesson in manners and a boot in the ass. Not necessarily in that order either. Now, folks, I know I'm not being very informative here, and I apologize for that. I really should just keep quiet, but I'm just so peeved. That is. Can I try this? Oh, dude, hell yeah. Fuck that Jeep. You kidding me? Good. Alright, let's see what's over here. Oh, goodness. Welcome back to KBF FM. Hope you enjoyed that too. Now, Doc, you were talking about life and finding that special someone, that soulmate. Well, you were talking about that. I was saying I don't buy it. Well, see, to, to me, that's strange, because I have to paint you as a hopeless romantic. <laughs> you got me there, Pat. I love radio. Now get me the hell out of here. Hell yeah. I'll look inside here. Is this a coal mine? This looks more like a lumber yard. Thank you for letting me climb over that rock. I did not have to suffer the consequences of my actions. Today, at least. They're like a manuscript. Or, or a coffee mug. You'd land on the bucket and break fall damage. Genius. I'm a fucking genius. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh sh uh oh. <laughs> Damn. Oh man. Wait. Excuse me. Oh goodness. Save? Does not. Bucket shots? Fucked up bucket shots? Oh, visitor parkings. 
guys. Sorry. Was early. I was supposed to meet the kidnapper at noon in the main building. The right right here. Was it was close enough. Oh, good enough. In front of the the bar. Have like that axe or that pickaxe? What about this tractor? No love for a homie. I didn't want to go outside. Cops had to be looking for me. The noon sun turned the place into a sauna. The day dragged on. Different scenarios ran through my mind. Ways of how I'd torture the kidnapper to get Alice back. Or the different horrible things he could have done to her. I imagined her dead. I had no way of knowing she was still alive. It was killing me. I was running on blind hope. It was all a waste of time. The bastard never showed up. <laughs> a really funny idea to do as a kidnapper. Ask for ransom and then don't show up to collect it. Wake, where the hell are you? Change of plans. You know where Mirror Peak is? It's a big mountain north of where you are. You follow the path from the mine, you can't miss it. There's a lookout point there. I'll be waiting. I'm through being jerked around you by you. You want to see your wife alive? I want to talk to Alice. Yeah, and I want the manuscript. Don't keep me waiting, Wake. Hello? Hello! Ah! I'm gonna kill it! I had to get to Mirror Peak. Well... Uh-oh! That's not good! Well, I would leave the building if I could. I don't know why I, I won't just unlock the damn door, but... Uh, what? Heart attack? What is happening? Is is he vulnerable? Did I make him vulnerable and I it just Okay, chill out everybody. What even just happened? Enough. 
evil mine cards. Yeah, I got the toy. What the fuck is going on? What is happening? Yeah, I got I got the collector's edition. It, there was a flashlight inside, <laughs> just a normal flashlight, and uh, it, it, it was it was scary. There was there was also a revolver in there. It was it was loaded. It was a snub nose. It had, it had like six shots in there. There was a note that that just said kill 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 over and over again. It was weird. It was in a box of Lucky Charms too. I don't, know. I don't know why they put it in that. Like cornflakes would have been better. Big and scary. The only way to reach the hillside ahead was to go through the building. I had to find a way to avoid electrocution. It's a. Uh, it's kind of crazy to me that this game is getting a sequel. It'll at least look better, I guess. But I don't. I don't know. Game really needs one, maybe. having like mining equipment flung at me is is awesome. Oh they broke my car. I was using that. Wow. Wow, I just got fucking comboed. They just street fighting my ass. Page down there. Well, I'm down here now. We'll check. Is not scary. <laughs> Don't forget your lunchbox. Ooh. 
dude, actually, I don't know if you're still listening, Caden. I gotta study up, actually, on this game. I gotta study up. I, I have to get really good at it. Because this is gonna be the Silent Hill 2 remake. This is what it's gonna be. It's just gonna be Alan Wake, bro. You're gonna have, like, cinematic dodging. You're gonna, you're, it's gonna be, like, this over-the-shoulder type of thing. Dude. I gotta get ready. Dude, thank you, God, for auto aim. Worst auto aim in a video game? Question mark. Worst auto aim in a fucking video game? Dude. I said, um, I have to study up on this game. I have to study up on this game because this is what the art, uh, this is what the Silent Hill remake is gonna be. It's gonna be Alan Wake. You're gonna have like cinematic dodging. You're gonna have, it's gonna be over the shoulder. So I have to get ready actually. Oh my God, dude, this game is pointless. What the fuck? Why even allow me to shoot things? If I can't, you won't let me. You're allowing me and also not. This game has given me the keys to, to do something and then changing the locks. <laughs> okay, I'm assuming that's not where I'm supposed to go. Trust no one in the d -d 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 dark. Is this a ladder? Oh, this is a ladder. Okay. Dude, okay, so you don't even have to, like, aim at people. You just have to be, like, somewhere around them. Is my Mustang there? Really happy. Bang grenades were standard power company equipment. On wake might be the smartest man in existence. Oh, that's why I get rid of them. They hurt if I touch them. Dude, I didn't even know. <laughs> I had no idea. They're like on... Normally they're like right here, bro. This, this black gunk is right here. It's on the side of like a wall. You can't possibly touch it.
actually. Whoa. No, but there's a thermos up there. There's like a flare in this in this mine shaft. Okay, it was actually something. Oh no. I better use my flashbang. Really? He didn't even like die. Actually, wait, you. Sorry, I was on my phone. What's going on? Oh, hey guys. <laughs> That's fine. That's a fun thing this game gives you. I like the flashbangs. Alan probably should have like a Concussions from how many I've thrown in his face, but it's fine. Ooh. I just realized I need to stream a good MGS game one day. I've only streamed Twin Snakes, it's a funny prospect. Dude, how fast are people running out of batteries? Am I just like really good at conserving them or is this like way too much? Switch to pump action? Oh! It holds so much more. It's so much better. What if I started going that way and then now I went this way? Let's test this out real quick. Well, that kind of blows ass actually. I wonder if a group of three evil people spawn and, and try to kill me, like they normally do. It 
It was five this time. Not normally five. Dude, I I couldn't possibly turn around enough. Oh my god, I'm fucking back here. I, I don't have enough time to turn around and, I and no do that. I was going to give the kidnapper all the manuscript pages I had for Alice. If that wasn't enough, I'd hold him at gunpoint and make him talk. Wait, isn't there something back here? Oh, I maxed out the shotgun. Shotgun ammo. Crazy. So there's literally no point to go to the right. There's nothing. There's actually just nothing there. Just more woods. I don't really want to. How did it go all the way across? Okay, it still killed them. That's fine. Fucking roll down the hill, Brody. God dang. Where the fuck am I? Where am I? What the fuck? I went around that rock and I got so lost. What was that? What is that area? I had no real plan. I was going to give the kidnapper all the manuscript pages I had for Alice. If that wasn't enough, I'd hold him at gunpoint and make him talk. Dude, I get hit twice and I'm... What happened? I feel like this they've gotten like so much stronger since I last played. I get hit twice and I'm like, I, I'm red screened, bro, and dead zombies. I was going to give the kidnapper all the men I had for Alice. If that wasn't enough, I'd hold him at gunpoint and make him talk. Dude, I love how the flashbang is able to constantly just miss everything so it doesn't detonate instantly. You have to throw it literally in their face. Dude, how am I not dodging this?
How am I not dodging it? I'm literally pressing it at the right time. What are you talking about? Oh my god, fine game. I'll take my fucking time. Jesus Christ. I don't care enough. Please just let me go. I'd hold him at gunpoint and make him talk. Oh my god, swap the fucking gun, bitch. Damn. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? Finding all the fucking guys again. What changed? What is the difference between my dodging, like, when I am dying, and then that? What's the difference? The same. Rare moment. Flashbang worked instantly. presence was moving ahead of me in the same direction I was going. A cold feeling settled itself in the pit of my stomach. Was it going for Alice? The graveyard shift may cause cancer. Oh my god, I have a boss. This is a boss fight? Who are you? Dude, with the fucking musical stings, holy shit! What is the reason, brother? Just FOV? Dude, turn it all the way up. I didn't even know this existed. All that, all that, just so we could die instantly. Oh my goodness. Go around. Oh, I guess I was supposed to lead him in here. Actually, my method might have been easier, <laughs> honestly. The place was dead, 
A ghost town. Had been for decades, maybe a century. Who? There's nothing in there. Ray Peak Gorge. Fuck off, <laughs> actually. Oh my god. Oh, I could have. No, I swear I, I zoomed in on the. Uh, the. What was it called? The. Oh god, I don't remember what it's called. I don't remember what it's called. I completely forgot the fucking like, um, industrial uh, vehicle. <laughs> what is it called? It's got like a barrel on the end. I managed to make my way downstairs. Bulldozer. It's a bulldozer. Books and papers by Thomas Zane. It's very hard to focus, but I managed to read some of it. He's a poet, and a good one. He writes of muses and creators summoning fabulous things from a magic lake. Using his powers to shape the world of a realm of gods and dreams and demons, dark things that wait for a chance to slip through, wearing the flesh of men as disguise. Zane writes about himself, his girlfriend being taken over by a dark presence, about growing scared of the lake. Zane believes it's a mirror to the gaping void of darkness above, where some Lovecraftian presence lurks. I crawl back upstairs. I'll borrow these things from my story. They ring true. They fit. How much longer do I have to go? The kidnapper had sent me a text. The message was full of spelling errors and insults. It was telling me to hurry up.
Dude, I have so much flare gun ammo. Oh my god. Don't crash. No way. Did it actually? It- Oh! It didn't actually. What the fuck? It, like, froze for a little bit. fell down. Oh, it is. I did go the wrong way. What the hell? Fucking idiot. Shut up, ghost wife. Shut up. I'm walking here. Is that yellow? No, it's me going crazy. Actually hurt me. That's kind of dope. I didn't think it would. Dude, I need to stop going to bed so late. It's making me want to kill myself. mine shaft in order to go on maybe the machinery could help me with that <sighs> Dude, 
Dude, I was gonna go nuclear. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, I see. I see. Okay, I see what's going on. And a little bit more down there. That's fine. Wait, I just got owned. Puzzle, or oh, it is a puzzle. Do you think I can make this jump? <laughs> yeah, but it only like sets me back. It's only detrimental to me. I'm goaded, I'm goaded, I'm goaded, goaded, goaded. Excuse me. Oh my god. This game makes me more exhausted. This level is long. There's birds. Oh, jeez. Well, that's not good. Oh, great. Another cable car. Just great. What are you complaining about? Do you have a fear of cable cars? I mean, that's... That's... A health hazard. That's dangerous. The powerful flashlight. Actually, what I fucking thought. Oh, 
<laughs> That's fine. Manuscript. <gasps> Even better! Hey, I got the achievement. <laughs> Didn't know it was just five, I thought it was like 13. But. We were a long time ago. Maybe I was just tripping. Lake, the eighth deepest lake in the world. You even see it down? There? You can't even see, it. dude. This is a valley, no lake. Dude, this guy is such an asshole for changing the destination to actually at least like three miles away Manuscript pages on my own. This one is so fucking long. Surely it would have been easier just to climb on it. <laughs> the mountain ruins. Dude. Alan, you're being trolled. You're being trolled, dude. He has killed your wife. There is going to be nothing left. Um, Dom, I miss you. Dom. I'm insane. Talk to me on the tea. Oh, jeez. The lore. 
Cynthia Weaver. Oh baby. I love lore. Basement brother. I'm full on hunting ammo. Goated. Is happening. Cool. That is awesome. Okay, so we're just gonna flare again on this because I don't want to deal with this, frankly. Dude, why is it so hard to shoot this thing? God. You're trying to get me killed, dude. If you uh, knew exactly where to go, you could avoid it. I could see Cauldron Lake. I thought I could make out the spot where the island and the cabin had been. There was a light near it. It had to be a boat. I was close now. I had to get there fast. I dreaded what I would find. Wait! Are you? Wait! Hey, I'm here! I'm coming! Uh, no! Get away! Sorry! Please, lady! The boss didn't know who he was messing with! I, I didn't know! I swear, I didn't know! We don't have this place! We don't know where she is! She's probably around! Who just said we had her to make a play ball? You see? You see? Get him writing for us, please. Please, oh, I'm sorry. Dude, they. Oh, okay. He's here. I thought he was on the boat, and I was like, I was about to say they have to be yelling so loud. Wow. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> There goes all my items. Okay, so he's dead. Yeah, he just died. Rest in peace, game over. Bad ending. Damn, that's tough. Can't win them all, unfortunately. There was someone dragging her down.
Are we? It's a long episode. I don't care. Stay calm. We don't want you to have another episode. You're a patient at my clinic. Have been for a while now. The shock of your wife's death triggered a mental illness. No, you're... you lie. You're suffering from various symptoms of undifferentiated schizophrenia. Fast. It's okay, okay Alan. Just, Just let, let go. Go, 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 go. <sighs> Diagnosed schizophrenia. I felt groggy. Whatever Hartman had bumped in me was making me numb. I felt like this was happening to someone else. Someone I was watching on television. I couldn't think. I couldn't Watching on television? Oh! Oh my god! Dude, it's uh, it's Cry of Fear. There's, there's TV Alan Wake and then there's real Alan Wake. And real Alan Wake is in a wheelchair somewhere. Good evening, Alan. Are we feeling better now? Feeling calm? Yeah. I see you brought your pet gorilla with you. So sure, I'm calm. I get the message. Loud and clear. Quite right. That's the spirit? You're being very brave, Alan. I understand you're confused. I would be more concerned if you weren't suspicious of me. I don't blame you for it. Big of you. Now, why don't you come with me? We'll reacquaint you with my clinic and go over everything you might have forgotten. Little walk and some fresh air? Yes, it will do you good. This corridor is for patients. Most of them are here right now. Jack took them out for a fishing trip. Except for the ones who are particularly vulnerable, of course. I encourage creativity as a part of the recovery process here at Cauldron Lake Lodge. I specialize in treating artists. I bet you do. Splendid, Alan. I honestly believe we can get this thing under control if we work together. This way, Alan. Anderson? Elevator? You have an elevator in here, by the way? What the fuck? In this lodge? This is not the craziest thing ever, but... Okay. I thought these were all different floors <laughs> for a second. Now, Alan, from past experience with you, I know I need to get right into the heart of the matter as quickly as I can after an episode. So I'm just going to say this. Alice is dead. No. You're in a very vulnerable state until you understand and accept this. Alice drowned. And you couldn't face that. You're suffering from hallucinations. No. Paranoid delusions, unusual thinking, an obsession about light and darkness, a feeling that everything revolves around <laughs> you. Man who thoughts and dreams. Coming to terms with the death of his wife. Your mind has constructed an elaborate fantasy scenario in which your writings are affecting reality. She has been kidnapped, and supernatural forces of darkness are trying to stop you. Trying to get a, a good shot of his face. We go this way, Alan. I wasn't ready for another shot, so I went along with it. He had to be lying, but under the influence of the drug he had given me, I had to fight not to believe his words. It's all in your head. You've been making it up. Apart from the tragic accident with your wife, no one has been killed. Your delusions are just a manifestation of your subconscious mind trying to protect you. I've been running around the fucking woods in these Unless shoes. The fantasy, it will Damn. Return. I know the instinct. I haven't given Mr. Wake enough fucking credit. Doesn't this make far more sense than the insane supernatural conspiracy you have concocted in your mind? You're a skeptic by nature, Alan. We both know this. Everything can be explained logically. Is 
this hitman. I'll push him off the railing and I'll get points because it'll look like an accident. I never get tired of this view. Very inspiring, isn't it? Cauldron Lake spread below us. I could see Mira Peak on the other side of the lake. I thought I could make out the spot where Diver's Isle had been when I arrived with Alice. Now there was nothing but waves. It seems there's a storm coming. Funny, I don't recall there being a mention of that in the weather forecast. Well, no matter. This way, follow me. Alan, what I'm telling you is good uh, Right now we're in control. Please. Every time you have a relapse, it gets more and more difficult to resurface from the dark depths of your imagination. Not surprising, considering your profession. Imagination is what you work with. After all your nightmares, this should come as an immense relief to you. If it doesn't, why is that? Because I'm lying? Or because you don't want to admit that you're not well? It's very natural for you to think of me as your enemy. It's part of the illness. I let him talk. After all, Hartman I'm the one trying to bring you voice. out of the world. His words you've constructed echoed madly yourself. inside my head. But I can't. I dug do my it nails into myself. the palms of my hands to stay You focused. need to work with me. Once you accept that, we can begin the journey towards your recovery. Come along. Let's go inside. Oh, here's the entrance to the office wing. Oh, yeah. That's for staff only. Scary, you were impressed scary, by my trophies scary. when you first arrived here. I do love to hunt. The great outdoors, <laughs> man versus nature. It's wonderful. <laughs> Pretty damn wonderful, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I got you. Got gotcha you good. Emerson. I'm a real bad dream, mister. You should be afraid of me. Don't want to run into me in the night, that's for sure. Dude, this is a guy. This is a normal guy in GTA. This would be like fucking OG Loke or something in San Andreas. You can't just decide what kind of dream you have or when you have it. Emerson. Okay, okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Boo. That's Emerson. We're actually making some progress with him, I'm happy to say. He works on... Video games. It's trash, of course, but it's trash, of course. Small creative effort, which makes him receptive to my therapeutic methods. Oh my God! Get me out of here now! I'm gonna lose it. Oh, there's a QR code to read, guys. Come on, I have to read this QR code. AlanWake.com/slash/tag3. Now what is now what is this fucking garbage? Oh, that's not Alan Wake. That's Sam Lake. This way. It's a, it's a the fuck. It's like a Max Payne meme. <laughs> they got the fuck. They got Sam Lake to do it. What the hell? Alan, this way now. You might have noticed the typewriter in your room. You've been writing as a part of the therapy. As soon as you feel up to it, you should continue. I'm not reading that. My rheumatism is killing me. There's a storm coming. Oh, guys aren't crazy. Storm. These are just like base people. And wipes this place off the face of the earth. And these two are the Anderson brothers, Odin and Tor. They had a, how should I put this, a heavy metal band in the 70s and 80s called Old Gods of Asgard. They even adopted new first names to complete the image of Viking gods. After the band broke up, they lived on a farm nearby. They are, well, in advanced stages of dementia. They're well cared for, TLC and all that. There's nothing more that can be done. I'm afraid that the rock and roll lifestyle has left its mark. No, that won't do. I'm so sorry to cut this short. For now, Alan, the power has been acting up. I'd better go check on it. We'll continue this soon. 
Meanwhile, when you feel up to it, return to your room and try to write. It really is for the best. Don't you think? I'd like to bash his head in with a hammer. Oh, he'd love to fish out our secrets, but he has no clue. He's not crazy enough. <laughs> not crazy like us, Sonny. Yeah. Being ah. crazy is a requirement, Sonny. Who else could understand the world when it's like this? It takes crazy to know crazy. That's the sanest thing I've heard in a while. <laughs> <laughs> Say, you're all right, Tom. Hey, we like him, don't we, bro? He's got to go to the farm. The Anderson Farm. Valhalla! We wrote it all down, lest we forget. A crash course. All you need to know to get your head right. You need to find the message. Here, Sonny, here's something for you. Gave me a rash, but I kept it safe from these bastards. My head Thanks. was clearing up, or according to Hartman, I was sinking back into the fantasy. I was convinced he was lying to me about everything. Crazy or not, the Andersons made more sense. Checking on him now. Yeah, good thing he's not overreacting. The doors or were locked. Hartman well, and the nurses the would have keys, I may need a but there was no way to get my hands the on bound to make you know who jumpy. You know. Okay, one second. Oh, I'm back. Oh, my goodness. Gotcha. The doc's got me looking at the wake here. But Something's wrong. I'm not myself. It's hard to think that there's a shadow inside my head. I can only focus on writing. Everything else is a blur. I'm trapped in this cabin. Have been for days, but it's always dark outside. My editor is real. I saw her again. She's not human. It's not human. A dark presence is wearing the old woman's face. She was covered in clinging shadows. There's a hole in her chest where her heart should be. I think I've made a horrible mistake. I don't think I'm any closer to saving Alice. It's been lying to me, using me to get the story it wants, and the story will come true. Cool. Oh, God. Oh, God. Wait, this is my room. The white glare of the blank page in front of me hurt my eyes. My hands began to shake uncontrollably. Hey, wake. You stay here. I'm gonna go see what's up. You just keep doing what you're doing. Be cool, okay? I didn't know what the chaos was all about, but it could be my only chance of getting out of here. Where the hell did he get a dairy? I don't know. Here's a friendly poke from me, old witch. Oh, afraid of the crazy brothers, are ya? Not so weak now, are we? A manuscript. Sinclair looked bad. That wasn't a love tap. It's the crazy old storm. Hard. I'm 
I'm taking she was one it. of Hartman's goons, she had it coming. <laughs> to get the key to the office room from Sinclair. The backstage is all I yours, had to get to Tom. Hartman's office. Seize your taken destiny. all my manuscript pages. That's where he'd been keeping them. All my manuscript pages. on the tape said they were recordings Hartman now, Mrs. had made Wayne, in his sessions with his patients. Can you tell me about Alan's problems? I saw Alice's name on one of them. More and more moment, out of control all the time. I couldn't believe it. The parties, he's so angry all the time. He's getting violent and he's... Do you mean with you? No, not with me. No, never. I... Sometimes I almost wish Alan would take a swing at me. <laughs> I like this painting, like of a, of a crow thing. I like the concept art. Obviously, just concept art as as paintings. It's a classic. Uh, and I like this wolf. I like the wolf and the crow. This one's like kind of funny. I don't know if I would own it. Yeah, actually, I would. It would be like, <laughs> I don't know where I would put it in a house though. That'd be funny. Funny idea to think about. Oh my god. Hey, Barry. Barry. Man, I'm glad to see you. We need to get to Hartman's office. It's right next door. You okay? Yeah. I mean, no. The cops found me a Rose's trailer, but... These were all the pages I had on me. And more. Alan, please, you're sliding back into the... Tell me one more lie, and I'll shoot you in the face. <laughs> ah, well, it was worth a shot. Really, Wake, come on. Let's work together on this. You have no idea... Hartman, shut up! Barry, get out of here. I'll catch up with you. Get a car. Oh, Al, let's just... Go! Wake, listen to me. This is a mistake. Don't you see? Together we can create something absolutely wonderful with your ability and mine. <laughs> I needed light to get the possessed bookshelves out of my way. Ow, I, I, what's even hitting me? Just, I guess just don't touch anything. Or your head will explode. Uh, okay, upstairs I guess. Why isn't it working? 
Wait, I have an idea. Oh, it didn't work. <laughs> Dude, the QR codes on the wall is probably like the weirdest part of this game. This is gonna be gnarly. Dude, it didn't even move. <laughs> it stayed still. Okay, it only had to hit this one once, thank god. Ow, ow. I'm here. Wait, Barry, what if there's like cool things here? Uh. Barry, there wasn't anything cool. Thanks. Oh God! Look at the house, Al! Look at the house! Oh. Wait, I was looking at the house. The house. The house. Start right. Those evil guys. Jeez, not the evil guys. Big guy, I didn't even realize. Oh my god, the double swipe is so stupid. Holy shit.
I died? Oh my god. Dude, fuck this... this bird. Bullshit! Um, where am I? Oh, yeah, 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 no, this is... <laughs> the fucking... Like, a vocoding on it. It's so funny. the birds I think they should remove birds from horror games, actually. They're not fun in Resident Evil and they're not fun here. I just got fucking torn up. Who shreds? Okay. Oh, is that a hunting? Oh, that's a shotgun. It's fine. I stared at the Viking paraphernalia that littered the area. Emil made me made Tom do it. My boy Emil. My boy Emil. But he was so cool in two games he was in. Near Replicant and But he was cooler in Replicant definitely. Automata, he was just a car. That was cool still, I guess. Oh, oh god.
Let's get out of here. Can you open this gate? Maybe. Barry. Uh, well, I slammed it shut when the nasty showed up, and the key fits kind of loose in the lock, so, uh... Slide me. For the nearest, you're now leaving Bright Falls. Come back soon, sign. We're going to the Anderson farm. I knew you were gonna say something like that. You know what? You owe me big time for this. When this is through, if we make it, I don't care what anybody says, I'm done with darkness. You're gonna buy me a tanning bed as a gift, and I'm gonna live in it. Crazy, but that's fine, Barry. <laughs> oh, you got that right, Al. You're barking mad. You are You're barking mad. But maybe that's inevitable when you deal with crazy stuff like this. It helps. This is happening, Barry. Alice, they never had Alice. She's trapped in the darkness at the bottom of the lake, but she's not dead. Al, how can you know that? I know, Barry. I can. Al, I know. Listen, I can bring her back. I can find her. There's something special about this place. The lake, it, it does something to the works of art created here. It makes them come true. But there's a catch. The dark presence, whatever that thing is, twists it to its own ends. That's why all of this is happening. It's using my manuscript to take over everything. Al, I believe you. It happened to Thomas Zane before. It happened to the Andersons. I believe you. Crazy or not, you're not delusional. Weird shit's going down. That's a fact. I'm on board, man. I'm with you. The Andersons knew about it, but they were too far gone to tell me with all the drugs they were on. But they wrote it down. There's a message somewhere at their farm, Barry. We just need to find it. Look out! <laughs> wow. You completely ate shit. It was a total fail. Oh my god. Oh shit, sorry. I have my volume all the way up. I'm on Instagram. Oh my god. <laughs> Barry was nowhere to be seen. Barry! Barry! Oh man, you're okay! Jeez, it's good to hear your voice! I was trying to get out of the car, but the ground gave way! Man, what a drop! Don't worry, your cutout is fine. Forget that! Are you okay? Oh. Hit some bushes, hit oh. a scratch! There's no way you can climb down though! Like a sheer wall. Uh, Al, there's something moving down here. Barry, it's a taken. Use a flare, Barry. Oh, yeah. Barry, are you all right? Flare gun. <laughs> I'm good, Al. I'm great. Guess he never messed with anyone from New York City before, huh? You're gonna have to find your way around to the farm, Al. I'll be waiting. Just. Over Barry, there, I'm basically for there. Me, okay? Ow! I'm not staying here. It's suicide. I'm going to the farm. I'm gonna go ahead and secure the area. You can catch up. Don't worry about it. 
Lost all of my shit again. Now he's Rambo. This would turn into a disaster if I didn't catch up with Barry. This is like the first time I've dodged furniture like that. It'll never happen again. Yes! Mr. Beast is a drainer. Oh, baby. Wait, I lost it. I should just like jump across, honestly. It would be like way easier. Guys, how do I get down? How do I get down from this fucking mountain? And I've been on my phone this whole time. I was not looking at the path. Where am I? Also, Alan Wake would be dead right now <laughs> under normal circumstances. You just got hit by a fucking train. Oh my god, why is every path in this town just... Crazy. Ow. Crazy long and complicated. Like, how am I going through the. Why do I have to go through, like, mines to get to this farm? I think a highway would go well here. still be a working generator somewhere around here to power up the old lights by the gate. <laughs> I could sense the movement in the woods ahead. Facing the enemy without a weapon was dangerous, but I had no choice. There's no one in the dark. Dude, I've seen that same graffiti 17,000 times. I get it. Dude, what is even the point of having these fucking generators? You're never gonna have the time to turn them on.
Oh, I almost made it too. That blows. I could sense the movement in the woods ahead. Facing the enemy without a weapon was dangerous, but I had no choice. Here. I don't, I don't I don't think I can climb that actually. A car was driving away from the farm, headed in the same general direction as I was. For all I knew it was <sighs> caught in the consequences of leaping before looking. Oh my god, no more no more birds. trying to deliver each page to the right time and place. I'm trying to show you how the story goes. Ooh. I had seen glimpses of lightning. I had seen it in my dream. It was a strange spaceman or a diver in a bulky suit. He was the one who'd been placing the pages on my path. Tell him to stop. I don't want the pages anymore. Over them. I always had a fighting chance too, are you kidding me? I was never gonna lose. It's like the long way around, but I made it. I made it. Actually, I don't even know if I took the long way around. It might be just the correct way. Step in the bear trap. Can they step in bear traps? So I feel like they would have stepped in that one.
Oh. Dude, I got comboed. I got- Dude, I'm- I, oh, 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 oh. Come on, man. I was like right there. Dude, I'm being like perfectly comboed. They're so good at everything. Okay. I could see the car, but there was no sight of the driver. Hello? Anybody here? Ah! Barry! I don't think that's the front door. I think that might be the back, but it's okay. I know you. You were in jail the other day. I went to the farm again for the moonshine, you know? It makes you see. They're, they're not gonna miss it. They're in the loony bin. But my buddy, Danny, I lost him. Something's gone wrong with him. It's not him. Like a real bad follow-up to a real good movie. The best friend's suddenly the bad guy. Who wrote this crap anyway? I can't shoot him? Oh man. But I really wanted to. I've run through every possible course in my head. If I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. It's a horror story, and it's going to kill her, and me, and everybody in this town. No one will survive. Darkness will consume everything. This is what it's wanted all along. It will be free, unstoppable. It used Alice to get to me, dangled her in front of me to keep me going. It was never going to release her. I'm going to change this. I'll escape. I've written myself into the story. I'm now the protagonist. This feels like a terrible risk, but it's the only way to save Alice. I'll be bound by the events of the story just as much as anyone else who's been woven into it. The story must stay true for this to work. There have to be victims along the way. Near escapes. Cliffhangers. In a horror story, it can't be certain that the hero will succeed or even survive. He almost has to die. I'll write my own escape into the story next. I need help. Zane's going to be the one who will help me. I'll make it happen. Cool. These these TV segments are useless. Let me guess, Danny, huh? Mr. Wake going like, oh, I need to save my wife. I'm in the story. Like, yeah, bro, I know you're in the story. I'm right here. The fuck? Who you, who you think you fooling? Okay, get me in this, uh, in this car. Myself. But Barry, 
was Barry. I wonder how many coffee thermoses I'm at. God was with me, it would be zero, but I thought it was a dead end up here. Okay, well. I'll go back down to that cabin and see what's in there. Oh yeah, definitely switch to hunting rifle. No, no contest. Well, as I'm sure everyone's noticed, that storm we all felt coming is finally here. The boys at the weather service reckon it'll last until morning. At the very least. Not even stormy. Pertaining to that, let me uh, read that missing persons alert again. The sheriff's department still looking for a Caucasian woman, 30 years old, slim and blonde with blue eyes. She may be lost in the woods, and it's possible she's been injured in a car accident. If you see her, please make sure you get her indoors and call the sheriff. It's bad weather to be caught out in, so it can be. My wife. My wife. I don't think this. Get me in the car, man. I'm not interested. Oh no! Oh man. I totaled it. Let me run up and get the, the truck again, I guess. <laughs> Alan, you are useless. You can't run a fucking. You can't run an inch, dude. It's game over if 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 Alan fucking Wake has to go anywhere. Fucking save our souls, man. What's that? Didn't even see that last time. What is that? I was just like a gauge. If you see her, please make sure you get her indoors and call the sheriff. It's bad weather to be caught out in, so if you see stuff in the area, maybe look Dude, go down, you fuck. Why are you even resisting? Oh, 
Oh my fucking god damn it, dude. What? Ran him over like 30 times. There's nothing upstairs, right? I don't really remember. Completely forgot. My door, <laughs> my door, it's missing. Okay. That was a little uncalled for, I feel. No, I can totally fit this. Here, no, 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 I can totally fit it through. <laughs> Hold on, hold on, I can totally do it. Maybe get it an angle. I think like maybe, I think this will work. This is 1984. Speedrun trap. I made it push me forward. Um. Dude, what happened to this arm, bro? Oh, look at here. Ah. <sighs> I didn't know it would shoot automatically if I pressed it while pulling it out. It's, a, it's good to know, I guess. Are these fireworks? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. He power slid. God damn. I'm so glad you decided to go it alone, Mr. Bronson. Shut up and shoot. Ow! We have to fight them all! I can set off more of the fireworks from here and help you out! Dude, help at all, bro. What is your problem?
I'm not sure if this game is supposed to be a horror game anymore, honestly. I think the, the tone has shifted. I think, uh, I think when I started Chapter 4, it, the genre shifted. It's, it's like a parody of a horror game now. There's a lot right now. That works for me. <laughs> what even just happened? I noticed. How could I not notice? Oh, there, there is a fucking page over there. Seller, no reason to worry. Your cutout's good as new, right where I left it. I'll come back for it once we have the place secured. Yeah, that's been my biggest worry all this time. Probably like pages back here or something. What is going on over there? Sisters. The dream of dreams. Eh, that's by someone else. We join Mr. Jeff as he explores the endless dreamscape, only to be brought to a sudden stop by the second destruction. The Viking boat looked imposing, almost like a battering ram. Look out! Good 
Baton Rouge. It's um Oh, okay. It's an interesting tour list. They they just toured like every state that like on the edge of the country. Is monsters? Oh no. How are we doing on the manuscript? Oh, this chapter is almost over. If you're almost out of a manuscript, that means you're almost done. Yeah, not to lose it all. Easy enough. It was much easier than last time. There wasn't as much cover as in that graveyard. Wait a minute. There you go. <laughs> Easy enough. All shotgun ammo. Let them for little old me. I'm good. Keep your eyes open, okay? As you regular listeners know, I tend to work through the Listen to all of the radio shows? I actually did that. Deputies Mulligan and Thornton are taking a couple of moments off their business schedule. We have like two more studio. chapters. Boys, how busy are you now? Deer Fest is almost here, isn't it? I bet that keeps you in business. Pretty busy, yeah. Actually, Pat, we've been real busy with other stuff. Which concerns an ongoing investigation.
Dude, no way I can run into these hay bales and, and move them. I've got a brand- wait, 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 hold on. <laughs> This one, one second. Where is it? Your dog to keep boiling. Something I need. Dude, hurry up, Alan. Holy fuck. You are worthless, brother. Full hatred in that one. It's... It is so loud. Well, actually, I would. I'm surprised that isn't one hit. <laughs> oh no! I already killed the combine harvester. I don't want to stop this song. Why did that just fall apart? Okay. No more combine harvester. It was fun while it lasted. Shoot it. Just shoot it. What's the point, bro? Well, I guess they were right next door. Hey, what's the hold up? Come on, this place is all dusty. You know I got my allergies. God. Barry is such a wiener. Hey, let's go, man. Crazy place for crazy people. We should feel right at home then. Come on, one more gig. Let's do this thing. <laughs> the lights are out. Yes, we better check the fuse box. 
Dude, why won't this game let me shoot Barry? Holy, that is evil. The power downstairs was out, but I was sure I could fix that at the fuse box. Where's the fuse box? Upstairs. You know, this place looks kind of lived in. I thought the Andersons were in the booby hatch. Yeah. I don't think they keep too close an eye on them at the clinic. They seem to slip away a lot so they can get wasted. No kidding! Those guys sound awesome! Can you hear that, Al? Music? Of course. We need to find where it's coming from. That's the message the Andersons talked about. That's the whole reason we're here. Lady of the Light? Oh, that's gotta be... Watch your face, the crazy lamp lady from the town. Cynthia Weaver. Right. Must be. Wait, what? The record's probably just a little dusty. Give it a little Did not sound like it was playing from that table. Okay. We need to find Cynthia Weaver. We'll stay here for the night and head back to town as soon as it gets light. Hey, Al. Lots of hours before dawn. Might as well get some rest. And by rest, I mean drunk. Come on, Barry. This is... Yeah. Are those bottles, like, rusted metal? <laughs> like, what is that? That doesn't look like any bottle I've seen in my life. Stick by you, no matter what. Ever, Al. Sure. Like Ever, a Al. I'm a writer. God damn it. Correct. If I just wanted to, I could write ten books a year, and and they'd be the best books that year. No, you couldn't. That's right. I couldn't, but I could, cause I'm a writer. What? Dude, fake drunk I is this stuff. so my funny. Brain is coming out of my nose. And how awful it is. <laughs> Get the recipe off those coots and be a, a, a booze millionaire. I just miss her, Barry. I just want her here with me. I know, Al. I know. But it's gonna be okay. We're gonna make it okay. Alan Wake. <laughs> what is going on, bro? I'm so much taller. It's all right. I'm coming. It was a crazy drunken dream. And yet, it was more than that. It was the truth. A suppressed memory unearthed by the Andersons' moonshine. I was there, an out-of-body observer. This was the night Alice and I had arrived at Bright Falls. The night Alice had disappeared. I had a chance to find out what had happened. Alice? I Alice. remembered being surprised to see the cabin dark. Alice would have never turned the lights off. I remembered thinking I caught a glimpse of her form underwater sinking into the darkness diving after her was the last vague memory i had of that night after that the next thing i could remember was waking up behind the wheel of the crash car and finding the first pages of the manuscript beyond this lost memory there was nothing i had to follow the footsteps of my past self to find out what had happened that night i couldn't find her in all that blackness i must have thought she drowned 
Jagger had Alice, Alice, and so she had me. Alice! <coughs> I'd been easy prey. Look at the cabin. Is there someone in the window? Alice? Maybe she didn't drown after all. Maybe she's inside. Alice! Yes. Had touched oh, me. She had dug her nails into my brain and used me, made me her puppet. She must be here somewhere, maybe upstairs in the study. Alice! Yes, that's where she is. You can apologize. Alice! You laugh at the whole thing together and put it Alice? behind you. She's not here. You were foolish to think so. No, she's dead. She drowned. No, no, no! It's your fault your wife is dead. You are guilty. All she wanted was to help you right. You killed her. Ah! Oh, hush. There's still hope. Cauldron Lake is a special place. Here, you have the power to change things. She wanted you to write. I will tell you what to do. You can write her back. The story will come true, and all will be well again. She had Alice, and the manuscript was the ransom for her. Yep. <laughs> yes. All right. I'll fix it. I'll bring her back. Whoa. No. I wrote it. I remembered it all now. In the dark, I'd written for days, a week, almost a complete manuscript of a novel entitled Departure. Jagger had been my editor, whispering in my ear, making sure that the unfolding story would make her more and more powerful. I thought I was saving Alice. Even with the cobweb she put in my head, some part of me had been aware enough to write my escape into the story, to bring a light into the cabin to release me before I could finish, to interrupt the horror story before the ending, where darkness consumed everything and everyone. Zeng was weak, and far away, but I had written him into the story, and his light had been enough to set me free. It isn't here now. I am here because it was written. I brought the light to set you free. You must hurry. We'll know I am here. It will be back soon. She stole the skin of my barber a long time ago. She looks so old. What are you talking about? I'd woken up, confused and groggy, my mind consumed by darkness and fear. All I could do was to escape. The week spent in the cabin had taken its toll. I was barely conscious and fading fast. Had to have cost Zane terribly, thrown him even deeper into whatever dark place he now haunted. But he had managed to weaken the dark presence, kept me safe that night. <laughs> Dude, oh my god, it's literally just like a, a movie playing in front of the in front of the uh, windshield. That's right, James Joyce. It's your fault, and you're gonna pay for it. 
Wow. Previously on up. Well, we're expecting a record crowd from the neighboring counties. Naturally, we hope to break the record set by last year's Moose Fest in our neighboring town, Watery. Ladies and gentlemen, some people have asked me, what's the big deal about Deer Fest? And I think that this sums it up. It's about friendship and community. We've got a great party coming up, but uh, let's try to hold it in until tomorrow and get through the night in one piece, all right? Someone will come for it when the time is right. Thomas said so. He wrote it. The key is insurance. It's my job to keep it safe. Safe in the light. Uh. Always in the light. Hello. Hello. All the manuscript pages were gone. The FBI agent had taken them. I think... I think my tongue just took a crap in my mouth. Ugh. Oh, wait, we're in jail now? Oh, help. Help, this is not good. That about sums it up. Oh, I am never drinking again. I need to talk to Weaver. She's the one in the song. The Lady of the Light. What, the crazy lady? Ugh, whatever you say, Al, but we're stuck here. Night, They're not yeah, gonna... Even interviewed Wade. I had some reading to do first, Sheriff. And let me tell you, it was an interesting read. Well, I've got you now, Raymond Chandler. It's all here. All the evidence, including conspiracy to murder a federal agent. There's no way you're walking out... Dude, this guy is so lame. Stop calling me random fucking authors. Uh, agent Nightingale, Dude. I want to talk to your superior. Well, we all want things, Sheriff. I wanted my... <sighs> Look, that's not possible right now. Agent Nightingale, I insist. <laughs> Wake, what's wrong? Lady, are you stupid? It's a trick. It's an obvious trick. Okay, I've had enough of this crap. Wake, I'm gonna trust you with this. You're joking. Agent Nightingale, your opinion would matter more if you were sober and if I actually believed you were here on official business. Whoa! Get, get back in the cell, Stephen King. Oh! Oh, Stephen King, like they said in the beginning. I know this. <laughs> oh my god! That is awesome. Light. We need light. It's the only way to fight this thing. In my office. I've got your things there. Follow me. Oh, man. We're sitting ducks with the lights out. The clicker. Stay cool. But here's the clicker. The emergency power on. Wait, this is a thermos. The hell? Here are your things. Wake, what do I need to know? What do you need from me? They can be hurt in the light, only in the light. And I need to find Cynthia Weaver. She can help me stop this. Light. Check. Cynthia. She lives in the old decommission power plant. I can get you there pretty quickly in the rescue chopper. Come on. The rescue Let's chopper? Dude. They used to wait their shotgun ammo. Wheeler, I need you to stay here. What? No. We're going to fetch our ride, but I have friends who need to be warned about this, and I can't be in two places at once. I need your help. Well, okay. Here's a list of people and phone numbers. I need you to call them and tell them you have a message from me. Night Springs, okay? They'll know what to do. Night Springs? Like the TV show? Gotcha. Oh, hey, that radio guy is on the list. Maine. Who's Frank Breaker? He related to you? My dad. Hey, is this like a secret society? Can you do this? You'll be safe here. The backup power's on. These guys need to be alerted just in case we don't come back. Uh, you'll come back for me though, right? As soon as we get the chopper ready. Thanks, Wheeler. 
I owe you one. Okay, let's go, Wake. Through the back. My hangover Something. wants a pizza. You think there's any way I could order one, Al? I must My be hangover tripping. wants you to shut up and get to work. Must have broken the gate controls. We can't reach the gate's control box from here. We need to get to the other side over the rooftop. I'll go. I'll open the gate for you once I'm across. You stay here in the light and cover me, Sheriff, okay? Crazy how useless the hitting graffiti normally is. If it's not an arrow, it literally does not matter. It's just saying the same thing you already know. Dude, that actually worked. Oh my god, go to. Okay. Look out! Oh no. But, but wait, there's there's something over here. It's a three flares. And that's it. <laughs> it's, that's it. Three flares. Well, I was wrong. It has something to do with flares, at least.
I'm right behind you, Sarah. I promise. I'm paying attention. It's crazy this game even gives you, like, the option. The option to switch. It's like, yeah. Obviously, I'm gonna want to switch. The fuck? Who wouldn't? I'm gonna want explanations to know. For example, what the hell happened to Rose? She's seriously messed up now. The same thing I think happened to me after I arrived. During this week, you can't remember? Oh, I remember now. Uh, yep. Nothing else to say about that. Hello. Dude, thank God. If she got stuck, I was gonna be sad. And I thought New Yorkers were rude. Nice. Um. Yeah, this is a. Uh... Strange. I feel like I've killed more people than the people who actually, the amount of people who live in this town. Holy fucking shit, dude. There, now go away. Damn. Didn't realize it was such a big deal. There's like something far away. It's a thermos. It's a thermos. I have to pick it up. Actually, just roll completely. There's a thermos. God. Okay, 
Someone's messed with the fuse box here, but you should be able to jury rig it while I find the keys. I already got electrocuted once today. How about I look for the keys and you get burned for a change? Fine. They should be in the clerk's office on the other side of the building near the main entrance. In a phone call. The message was from Barry. He was getting worried at the station. He wanted us to hurry. In Washington? Didn't even know that. Okay, Sheriff, I got the keys. Well, I couldn't, I didn't know where you were inside. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> Barry! He made it inside, Wake. He's okay. The storefront's blocked. Come on, Wake. Let's go around. That is we can meet him in the back. Insane. Okay. I'm gonna end it right there. It's silly. Actually, what actually Vehicles. Indirect kills. I mean, like other people. Mines found. Alarm clocks, cardboard standees, Night Springs video games. What are you talking about, bruh? Whatever. Bye bye, stream. Ugh. <sighs>